In this video, we fly a World War II jet armed with a 50mm cannon. This is the ME262 A1U4. Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to give the OGs some PTSD with this thing. This is the Narval. People used to take out the RU251 and just this thing and then wreck whole lobbies with it. But now it's not as good as it used to be. There are a lot more capable planes now at this BR and of course SPAA as well with the addition of BTRZD and of course the R3T20 and the Czechoslovakian 30mm thing. Now what makes this thing special is it can quite easily just fly around at 700 kph firing 50mm tank shells. Yeah, 106 millimeters of penetration, and this is with explosive mass. A lot of people go to this round, don't do that. I know it's got a higher pen value, but it's solid shot. What you really want is this. Once it goes inside the tank, especially if you're shooting down on top of the roof, it goes explode and tank go boom. Now, since the RU251 has gone to 7.0, I thought I would turn to the pack Puma, just because we've got APHE, a fast chassis, and I think it does really well at 6.7. And yes, it did really well at 6.7. So much so, this first game ended with a big bang. Okay, we got a really good map. It's actually very low light though. Let's see what we can do here. It's 7-3 uh, for sure. It might even be higher, I'm not entirely certain. We're going to do a bit of uh, flanking here. Hopefully we can take out some M18s and stuff quite easily. Hmm, 50 calls. The song of the American people. That and banjos. Asked an American guy if he would kiss his cousin for 10k. And he said, yeah, but it's going to be really weird kissing his ex. How have I got away with this? Every time though, right? I, I definitely hear angry men. Oh, he's right here. That is a terrifying sight, dude. It's like the one tank I didn't want to see. Holy crap. I would really like to get rid of this, man. I can't tell if he saw me or not. Shut up. How did I not... Dude... Are these guys literally blind? Clinical blindness. 100%. Someone's trying to shoot me through the trees, but he doesn't know where I am. Right, that's three. There's now a guy out this way. I've got to... I'm going to get shot from behind, but... We're... Depleting enemy reinforcements quite quickly. What are these guys doing? Is that guy dead or did I hit a wall? He's dead. Right. Um, I'm a little bit shook that this has happened. We've taken out some extremely scary things. Well, there's a guy here. Oh my, I took my tiger two ages. Kill, I think. Ah. Oh, my scout didn't work on that guy. T-92 we, We're in a We're in a good spot to get a nook here probably But The game has to last though Okay, 50 cows Is that for me? No We're gonna have to go up in our plane shortly I thought we might be able to get a nuke here, but it doesn't look like it's going to happen because the enemy team's not trickling in quick enough. Oh, I could have got that guy maybe if I was paying attention, but teammates are on it now. No big deal. He's behind this building, I think. Did you just fire at me? Oh, it's a T-92. I've got heat with me. But I need to try and explode its driver, probably. Let's try a bit of overpressure. What's the worst that can happen? 
No, da, este o zi eu. Ok, now he... Just is trying to repair as quickly as he can, probably. Ok, I missed him. I'm actually going to back up because he's dropping Ari on me. Oh god, ok, right, I'm actually going to take the L here. Let's get in our plane. We are some- oh god, we spawned so close to the- the battlefield too? This isn't fair. This isn't fair, dude. Okay, we got M19 or something. Oh, it's actually a BTR. Is what it is. Let's go see if we can find that... T92. There's another T92 here. This is a different guy. From the one we shot the transmission out on. I've lost him though. No, I haven't. He's here. He's got a 50 cal I can look up though. Okay, we got him crit. Which means his 50 cal is no longer active. We'll come back around for him again. I can kind of see him. He's got a little bit of tracer marker on the top of his tank. And I've... It's hard to see him because of the lighting. He's trying to move. Awesome. Guy on C. I don't want to interrupt the guy and see just so we can get some life out of this match. The BTR dude is scary though. There's definitely no one over this way sniping anymore. Don't think so. I think that M51 just perished. Yeah, he's gone. The guy on C is also dead. No, no, this guy's still alive. But my light tank is pushing him quite aggressively. I'm probably going to eat it by this BTR. It's a big boy. Oh my god, dude. This thing just isn't fair. <laughs> okay, I see I see another heavy tank there, but the BTR is a problem. He might be running out of ammo though. Okay, I see a lighter tank pushing the sea cap. I'm gonna have to take a odd route round here though to kinda avoid the BTR. BTR spraying at me. I I need to be a bit more conservative with my ammunition, I think. Oh god, fifty cows. Okay, there is a guy here. It's a scorpion. This is when... I wish this had at least like a couple of little machine guns. The scorpion's dead. But the BTR is now pushing up. Which is not great for me. Okay, 1882 is gone. So we quick spawn point check. 1800. We got plenty more to spawn another one if we lose this. I don't know if the big boy... That pushed C is also gone. I'm willing to bet he is. Let's uh, let's be very wary of the three aeroplanes that are coming in. Right, we're going to get some speed here. The T-92 is still out there. It's an SU-100. Okay, good. And I'm going to fly really low over this direction. The good thing about the low light is... Our camouflage works quite well at jipping other planes. I don't know where the third aircraft is. I used to be able to do quite well against other aircraft with this thing. My confidence, however, I, I don't really play War Thunder every day for like hours like I used to. So, I'm not super confident I can take them all on. And we're gonna have a hard time pinning that. See, I should have, I should have just taken the shot on that guy, but I didn't because I'm a coward. We're missing one other plane. He's really damaged. He's gone. Right, let's swing out this way. I'm pretty sure I saw one crash. That guy's still out there. Let's keep bringing him over our SPA. My murder's shooting at him. Enemies back on C. That might be the BTR. By the way. Let's see if we can help this teammate out with these two guys. I'm 100% sure I'm going to get buzzed by this BTR. He got me. <laughs> we, we got his engine out. I don't think that's going to be much help though. We got we got three, three tanks though. I'm quite happy with that. I think what I'll do is flag panzer first. Uh, okay, plane coming in. 
that's going to be my job. I know there's still a T-92 around somewhere. Let's just stay in the middle here. This guy looks clean winged to me. Although I might be very mistaken. I'm not sure what he's up to. Let's have a quick pause here. I can't believe I missed that. There goes the BTR. I'm so bad. <laughs> I'm so bad. IS2 is gone. <laughs> Angry dogs. <laughs> oh my god. Right, he, he's doomed. And I know there's another aircraft coming back in again. It looks like we're getting A though, right? How are we looking? Pretty close. This T-92 is still out in the trees. It's Ace Guy. Here comes the other plane. Bearcat. This, I think, is the guy who got damaged before. I gotta stay in cover though because uh, there's a T-26 E-5 coming. P-47 actually. I need to spend more time with SBA. I took one of his elevators off. Hit him again. And another aircraft. If I somehow manage to get both of these aircraft without dying, I think we'll actually get a nuke. This guy's coming straight in for our tank destroyer by the looks of it. Absolutely obliterated. I'm really concerned about this T tank coming over here. The US one. My teammates just shot him up a little bit. Okay, not a plane down. There is an SPA over here. I need to help my teammate. My Type 75 is in trouble. But I think we've got there. Damn. 2S3M just murdered my teammate over this direction, so that's not good. Dude, where is this guy? I can most certainly hear him. That's very unfortunate. <laughs> the CSU 57 too. I should have been a bit more patient, probably. I don't think we got the nuke, by the way. No, we did. Let's go. This is going to be a terrifying ordeal, I'll tell you. we got a Bombay door open quickly. All the enemy planes are gone, though. We only got three kills in the... 262, but... I mean, I'm not upset about that if we get nukes, then. Okay, this guy doesn't have any intentions of team killing me, and I'm very glad of that. Actually, our airfield shooting at something, and that's bad. The gen okay, my teammate just took out the SPA. This is going to be a very low drop. Don't hit the tree. And don't get killed by the 2S3M as well. Drop. Bombs away, then. Well, there we go. We got it. And GG to Beast Game and he almost got his too. GG. First game of the day. Always a good one when you get a nuke. First game of the day. With dogs barking. An emotional roller coaster. But there you go. Three deaths. Still have somehow managed it. <laughs> GG. That poor guy crashing in the background. <laughs> Right, dude, this is a great map. We we are actually... We're with USA this time, which means less annoying anti-cast. Well, saying that, Russia's still got that SU-11, right? Kind of elated with a nuke on, like, first game. What, what battle rating are we at here? 
There's a uh, IKB91, so 7-3. Oh, little weasel. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> I have to say sorry. <laughs> it's out of control. I had the brakes, but it just made me wiggly. Before everyone in the comments gets mad. I'm generally, I'm sincerely sorry. <laughs> How do we measure this? Oh, it's only 750. Did he stop there? I don't think you're going to bump me too much, my dude. I think he had reversed a little bit. Oh, I got strike. What even is this thing, by the way? Oh, it's a chariot here or something. Uh, we got him, and I see a guy down here, too. Uh oh. Let's back it up a little bit. Weasel to your, to your right, then. Okay, my teammate exploded it. There's a guy there. <sighs> That's my fault. Only fuel tank. Okay, teammate got him. This my weasel need help here. Do you need help over you got this guy? No, there's another one here. The weasel got him. The Type 61. Right, we got a kill and an assist, which is more than enough for a plane. Oh, crap. A BMP. I'm really surprised that pinned, to be honest. I was going for his turret. Um, <gasps> Fireworks. Oh, okay. We got absolutely disintegrated by a high explosive shell. Right, there's two planes up. There's one that's just dove. It's a Japanese prop, so I'm not really worried. And that's some twin engine thing I'm not worried about either. Unless it's a P-30A, in which case it's going to be a problem. What is that? Oh, it's not an issue. Right. We've got a man underneath us here. ASU-85. <laughs> oh, I almost hit that guy. He's about barrel stuffed them. So I, I can probably keep my speed up. And get this little tank destroyer down here from the side. Uh, he actually killed a teammate. Oh no. We got a jet. Uh, another prop, which looks like a super prop. He's going pretty quickly. We gotta get this mission done quickly. Oh, there's a BTR down here as well. Oh my god. This BTR is definitely going for me. Was that an R3 as well? Where'd the jet go? It's an attacker. Um, I'm a little bit scared of it. Just a tad. We're gonna try come around and see if we can catch him out. I don't want to head on with him, of course. That would be not very great at all. But going for the jet, I think, is the wise move. He's trying to strafe. Awesome. That couldn't have been better. BTR. I'm dead. 100%. Okay, we're, we're good. He didn't fire at me. I can't believe I had that shot. Just what I was saying in the first game too, right? Like, I um, don't have the confidence. You just gotta do it, dude. It just has to be done. Just, if you don't try, you don't get it. J-22 is a very low tier plane fighting this Japanese man. He's flying them back over. I really don't want to go near that. There's a... That 30 mil check thing is down there too. Can I help my team with anyone that's close to B or C? Without putting myself in a direct line of fire. Here comes another plane. The R3 actually claims the kill. 
And this guy's taking pot shots at me. So many good, viable anti airs for Russia now. Right, he's he's not very good at his taps. So I think I might try and challenge this aircraft further over this direction. Plenty of fuel, plenty of ammo. I don't see the aircraft. There's a buffalo here. I still don't see the aircraft. I see the R3. Okay. That's a very scary anti air. We're going to just move away from that. The other one's shooting at me too. Where the hell did this plane go? You swing around again? Oh, there he is. He's very interested in me. Let's just get some speeding out of here. See if we can get him to change his mind. That airfield's very close. I'm going to have to go around this way. <coughs> He's changed his mind. Good thing is, if he keeps doing that, he's going to get much slower than I am. Give me more of a fighting chance to just ground strike and avoid him. He's getting some altitude though. I might need to go up next to him. So he can dive on me as efficiently. Hopefully he doesn't turn into me. It's, well, actually, I kind of do want him to turn, turn into me a bit late. My team is doing extremely well. Oh god. He's dead. The plane did a loop. He's very slow now and we are extremely fast. Two more aircraft. Might be a jet back there. We're just using speed to negate them. It's easy enough done. My teammates are still fighting something near B. I've not seen any fresh spawns. Oh yeah, we do it and it's another one of those. Another zone Check 30 mils. F2G's doing God's work, dude. This guy's smoking too. Our two teammates have been firing into this spawn since the start. The ba Baxton guy. Teammate needs help. Never mind, he doesn't. Oh my god. Nice. We like that. There's another uh, a little fair, and there's no one left. <gasps> oh my goodness. It seems to be all over now. More anti-airs? Do my, my teammates fire into their spawn? This is what this map needs to change a little bit. There's another BTR. Okay, now he's stuck there. Let's get ourselves in that dogfight. Could be fun, you know. Oh yes, dude! <laughs> That's the one. That is the one. Oh my lord. Okay, we shredded that guy too. Did you still get bombs off? He blew me up. <laughs> he blew me up, dude. Oh, that's funny. Well, GG. We definitely took that victory. That'll be an M18. Shooting down walls. I know exactly where he is. Okay, here comes the 50 cal, I guess. No. Okay, T28 out there. 
So we can kill him, so I'm not going anywhere near him. This is not good, what are you? What's with these M18s, dude? Horizontal drive. Whose job I got is vertical, right? Right, I'm going to go the other way because that T-28 is this direction. Mm, that's not good. There's a bulldog up there. I'm going to avoid that. There's another guy here, look. Oh, I got killed by a T-3485. What is that thing with his gun up in the air? I don't know, I'm far too distracted. Right, there's a bear cat up, let's go. wonder if my teammates killed this bulldog. No, they didn't, I see him. I actually see two bulldogs. Well, that was an M51. The T-28 is coming across here. Ah, I see the other bulldog. This is another Sherman, actually. Okay, I thought that was a jumbo, and it was definitely not. What is this? A T-3485 guy? It was. Right, Doe 35 is under attack now. Fuck Wolf, your job is the aeroplanes. T-35 is doing good work. I see a BTR, so we're flying this way now. I don't know where the other aircrafts went. Oh my god, this team is getting an absolute stomping. Two BTRs. Three. Four. Possibly five BTRs. Oh, it was a TCM-20, one of them. That's a truck. Okay, we've got a fuel tank. Made his gunner a little bit sleepy. Back around we go. Okay, he's squirting 50 gals at me. I don't know where these enemy planes went. I think they might have crashed or shot down by our team. I I'm just totally unsure. Where'd that Jackson go? Okay. No thanks, sis. You do you. I'm gonna do someone else. Ah, found the bear cat. Ten years later. What are you? Don't tell me you're an SBA. No, he's not. Come here, little T-3485. Got a nice crit. Surprised he's not dead. I don't know what it is. I'm not getting the one shots with this thing like we used to. I don't think he has FPE. He's going to burn out. Yeah, he's gone. He put his fire out. Right, back around we go. Just need one more hit on him. Still don't see Bearcat anywhere. I think he's just being like really sneaky. Or at least trying to be. Good. Trying to skit all these anti-airs and 50 cows. Oh my goodness. It was a linecaster. This guy's just waiting to 50 cal me down here, look. We have so many planes coming back in. He's looking at me. He jet out. <laughs> he jet out. Right, another T-34. Oh. That's not a good sound. I'm trying to get underneath this dude. Ouch. Always the one engine. Oh, it's a Yak 3P. That's bad. 
This is not good at all. Okay, his bullets hit me even though they're nowhere near me. And the ones that <laughs> Jimmy Turner. Well, GG, we got we got an ace out of that. I think uh, this is a very quick match. So the narwhal is pretty good. It's not the giant that it used to be, but it's probably for the best. Once again, I'm really sorry about the FPS drops when I fly close to the ground. Uh, it's not anything to do with me limiting FPS. It doesn't change a thing. Even if I set it to 60 FPS, it still does exactly the same thing. It's something to do with the 40 series card that I have. Uh, and War Thunder specifically, it doesn't happen in any other game, but when I'm flying close to the ground, it uses 14 gigabytes out of the 16 gigabytes of VRAM that the card has. So it's something on Gaijin's end, and I have no idea how to fix it beyond some of the advice I've had, etc. Anyway, we're going to take suggestions for a video tomorrow. Let me know in the comments box what you'd like to see, and I'll start working on it tomorrow morning when I wake up. Uh, once again, thank you everyone for watching today, and thank you to everyone who supports me over on Discord and Patreon. To all those who are tier 3, that's Miss Lita, Shadow Wolf, Toast McGee, d is Sexy, White Wolf, Audible Bow, Bofey, Destari, Fearless Fighting Fridge Fish, <laughs> Fearless Germ, Mushy Boy, Pac Ma Puma, Royce, Rusty, Stoyan, Train Toilet, and Zig. And to everyone over on Patreon, it's Sickness Wind, Matthew S, Paul Wendrick's The Tackle Guy, FTN Watermelon, Shane McGuire, Ahenius, and a Stormwind. Brandon aka The Flying Pickle, Ethan Excavation Nation, Handsome Tatia, Kin the Salt Lord, Ralph, Rage, Tank Tonic, Tank's Gone Well, The Anomaly, Varian, Warpig Shaft, Mortaran, Stoyan, J Tormy, David, Pyrophoric, and the one, the only, Rosalini. And to everyone else still here, thank you very much for watching. Much love, and bye bye